Yo, what's up guys? You got Pokeaim here with this week's Battle of the Week. Sorry about missing last week. I went on vacation to Guatemala, and because I did not end up uh, getting to watch every single battle, I didn't think it'd be fair if I put up a Battle of the Week without having seen everything. But this week we are back. Guys, don't forget to check out all the coaches' channels because today there will be uploads of this week's battle. Mine in particular goes up at 2 p.m. Eastern if you were wondering. But let's get into this week's Battle of the Week. And also don't forget to let me know which battle you guys enjoyed the most. But for this week's Battle of the Week, I have to say it goes to Gator and Kale. From both sides, by the way. This is uh, I'm, It's recorded from Gator's perspective, but I think both sides played really well. I was really impressed by Kale's prep. You know, the Kale's record definitely does not show in this game. They both brought dual screens, which was absolutely amazing. Uh, it allowed Kale, who already had a pretty decent matchup versus Gator, to really make it tough on Gator this game. It actually came down a few times to Toxic landing. I know Celebi versus Kingdra. If Toxic had not landed on Kingdra, would have been a huge problem for Gator. But the MVP. The MVP of this game has to be Kangaskhan. Kangaskhan was just taking out Pokemon with Fake Out, wasting uh, screen turns as well, avoiding a burn from Torkoal, and in the end, it was able to take on Nidoqueen. So, the last Pokemon of Kale, giving Gator a very narrow 1-0 win in this battle. But that was my favorite battle of the week, guys. What was your battle of the week? Let me know down below. I'll see you guys. Check out all the battles going up today.